It's time now for Better Money with Joel Johnson. Today we're talking about retirement planning steps to take so that you're set up for success. Joel is a certified financial planner and managing partner at Johnson Brunetti. Thank you so much for being with us, Joel. It's good to be here, Carol. So there's some things that we want to do, especially this are if people are getting closer to retirement, just to make sure they're really ready. Right. I mean, the, the big question everybody asks is, am I ready for retirement? Am I going to be okay? Have I saved enough money? So it's real important that we answer those questions so that people can have more confidence in their financial future. Number one, you say visual visualize your retirement. What do you mean? This is kind of fun. I, I tell people, take a blank sheet of paper or a notebook and just write out your dream retirement, forgetting about any constraints you might have. Pretend money wasn't an issue. Pretend there weren't any other issues. Just write out your dream retirement. That's a great play, place to start building a plan. Okay, then you'll figure out your needed cash flow for said dream. You might have to adjust that. But. <laughs> exactly. This is where we get into a situation where, oh, it might be completely unrealistic. But we like to start with the dream. Start with the positive. And then how much cash flow are, are we going to need to do that? And there are things that people don't realize that they need, which usually in a conversation with us, we bring up a health care reserve account, maybe some type of an account to help grandkids with their education. Sometimes people don't think of those things when they're doing that dream exercise. And you want to know your risk tolerance. Yeah, and this is the big one because once you build a plan, you've got to stick with it. And what throws plans off are when people don't stick with an investment plan. You've got the big picture, which is the dream. You figured out how much income you need, now you invest your money and you've got to be able to stick with that plan. And then you need to determine your income sources because as you said, sometimes people are working longer or they've got a whole bunch of income streams from, I don't know, different jobs, different 401ks. Right. And again, the biggest concern people have out there is, am I going to be okay? Will I have enough income? So figure out where that income is going to come from. Does it match up with the need? Do you need to adjust that dream? It's got to be done within the context of a retirement income plan, which is why part of a financial plan that we do for everybody that comes into our office is building that retirement income plan. And this is a, an offer that people can help do that at home as well. It's the People's Retirement Handbook. And this is a book that you've written, and it's got the insider tips you may not hear from other financial planners. Yeah, it's my newest book. We talk about some insider things that go on in our business, but also it's got great practical advice and a lot of personal stories and what I've learned, Wendy and I have learned, in raising our kids and building our financial future. So you want to go to bettermoneytv.com to get Joel's offer, and you will send this to the folks who write in. We'll send it out to everybody, and we would love comments, so make sure that you get your copy of the book. Alrighty, thank you so much, Joel. Thanks, Kara. That's Better Money.